Yo there guys and welcome to my YouTube channel. In my last video tutorial, I talk about recording VBA macro and macro back end decoding. So in today's video tutorial, I'm going to show you how to use relative references and absolute references inside the macro gold group. Okay, let's get started. Okay, but let's say I don't want this. I want it to follow my step based on where I am. So, okay, in this worksheet, let me open another new worksheet. Okay, let me open another new worksheet. Okay, I will go again to the developer tab, then code. Then here, I will click on this button which says use relative referencing and this is this stock wood button in which means that now if i click on it it is activated you can see and but if if i click on it again it is not activated so let me click on it okay it is green in color which means that it is now activated now what i want to do is i want to record a macro where i will go to the right okay and i will color the cell so let's so let's record the macros i'll click on the record macro okay okay it's open record macro dialog box okay i will name it let's say color um, let me say color right or whatever things that you feel like naming it okay then i'll click on what okay button it is now recording i will go to the cell on the right here okay i'll go to cell on the right here then i'll go again to the home tab and now i will give give it a let's say a red color okay and that is it i will go to, back to the developer tab right up here then i'll click on stop recording okay so i'll click on now i will select any cell okay any cell in the worksheet okay i will select any cell in the worksheet let me select here okay and i will go to my macros and i will go to my macros then okay and i'll go to the color right option here okay and as soon as i run it you can see that it's moved to the right okay you can you can see so let me try let me do that again let me choose this cell here then go to my macro then choose the color right and what run it you can see that it moved to the right it's okay now so this is different between the using the relative references and when you are not using it if you are not using it then it will always go back to the cell that you are specified just like what we did in cell a1 earlier before okay now when i color it with color yellow so this is how you can record the macro and this is how you can go back and then check the code if you want you can cut short the code and then take only those lines that are required now there are a couple of drawbacks in recording a macro because you cannot do everything with recording of macro you cannot create a custom function for example here i am in sheet 4 and if i want to do something in what in sheet 3 okay if I want to do something in cheating and I want to and I want if I'm recording the macro I will always have to go back to what sheet 3 and do it but if you are only writing code okay or if you are just modifying a code that you are recording you can do something which will happen in the back end in the world in the sheet 4 okay right here okay and you can still remain in what sheet 
three. Okay, so these are some of these drawback of recording a macro, but it is it is one of the best way of learning VBA coding. The reason for this is that if you record your step and go back, then you can analyze and understand what is happening in the back end. You may not always know what to do and what are the objects in the world and what all that color indexes are and everything but if you record a macro and you go get go back it is a readily available available guide it will tell you everything that has happened obviously there won't be something which will be extra there will be additional redundant line but you will always get some help when you are recording a macro so this is how you can record a macro you can use the relative references or you can use the absolute references and this is how you can go back and learn go back and learn from the code so cope with all that i have said in this video i hope you found this useful and thank you